let go to go up higher. Hebrews chapter 12 verses 1 and 2. Therefore we also, since we are surrounded by so great a cloud of witnesses, let us lay aside every weight and the sin which so easily ensnares us, and let us run with endurance the race that is set before us, looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross, despising the shame, and has sat down at the right hand of the throne of God. So here's another important principle, an important truth about how we can step up higher, uh, move forward in our journey with God, and we take that principle and apply it to every area of our lives. That for us to progress, we must learn to let go. We must learn to put things off, let, let it go, in order to progress, to move up higher. What does this mean? It means that, for instance, we may need to let go of small, unnecessary things. There are things that maybe are busying you up and taking up your time, and these are unnecessary things, but these small things are the things that are keeping you from making progress. And you also, you and I may not even be aware of it. That some of these small things that we are, that are occupying our time, that are unnecessarily crowding into our lives, they are actually keeping us from making, taking bigger steps, greater strides in our race. So what do you do? Lay aside these unnecessary, these small things that are holding us down. Lay it aside. Sometimes we need to let go of insignificant battles. You know, there are things that come into our lives and there are some battles that are really not worth fighting. But you know, we get so preoccupied because we feel we have to win every battle. We cannot take the fact, uh, settle with the fact that we don't need to engage. And so we, can en we engage ourselves in every little battle that comes in our way. Uh, you know, we want to respond to every person who may point a finger at us. We may want to address every issue that comes up. And so we, we get involved in every little battle. But understand, there are some battles that are not worth fighting. And the energy and the time and the effort that you actually invest in those, un those unnecessary battles, if you consolidate all that and put it into the main battle that you have to fight, you will go so much further, stronger, and see greater success. So let go. Let go of the unnecessary battles. Choose your battles. Focus on what really needs, uh, what matters. Don't get caught up in trivial things. There are unnecessary things. There are things of low priority. There are things that don't even matter and don't get involved in those things. Let go of past glories. Sometimes we get so preoccupied by what, by what happened in the past. You know, five years ago, things were like this. And, oh, that was great. That was wonderful in those days. And, and so we are actually living in the past. We are here in the present, but we are still living in the past. You know, what does that do for us? It keeps us from journeying forward. We got to let go of the glories of the past. If you want to step up higher, let go. Let go of unnecessary things. Let go of the small things. Let go of the trivial things. Let go of the battles that do not matter. Let go of the glories of the past. You and I will step up higher. Apply this truth to every area of your life. Step up higher. Let's pray. Father, we pray that you are, you'll give us the understanding, God, of how to lay aside every weight, every encumbrance, so that we can run swiftly in the race that is set for us, so that we can make progress and at once step up higher, God. Show us the things that we need to let go, things that we don't need to get involved in, things that steal our energy, our time, our efforts. Give us wisdom. Pray in Jesus' name. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.